Hello everybody, here is IT News on Hetman Software Channel. Today you will see iPod Evolution, novelties by Microsoft, Google Updates, UFS 4.0 Storage, and Birds Attack 2022. iPod Evolution. On May 10, Apple suddenly announced it will stop production of iPod Touch 7th generation, the last model in the iconic range of portable music players. They will keep on selling the players as long as their supplies last, and then this product will no longer be available on the market. Although Apple does not plan to produce music players anymore, it promises that the spirit of iPod lives on in all its products playing music, including iPhone, iPad, and HomePod Mini. The end of iPod Touch 7th generation life cycle symbolizes the end of an era. As remarked by Apple, the first iPod was introduced over 20 years ago. The original model, featuring a mechanic dial and firewire interface, could only operate as a portable music player. But how did this line of products develop over the years? The original iPod, introduced on October 23, 2001, was the first MP3 player to pack an impressive 1000 thongs and a 10 hour battery into a compact 180 grams case. Another novelty, iPod mini, introduced on February 20, 2004, brought every advantage of the iPod into a small size at just 100 grams. After just two years, iPod Nano second generation offered a thin design, a bright color display, six stylish colors and up to 24 hours of battery life, and brought up to 2000 songs in users' pockets. Another step in its evolution took only one year. iPod Touch, first introduced on September 5, 2007, brought the revolutionary multi-touch interface that made iPhone a hit to iPod with an excellent 3.5-inch widescreen display. iPod Nano seventh generation, introduced on September 12, 2012, was the thinnest iPod of that time at just 5.4 mm and featured a 2.5-inch multi-touch display. It was followed by iPod Shuffle, the fourth generation, introduced on July 15, 2015, which offered a sleek design with up to 15 hours of battery life, 2 GB of storage good for hundreds of songs, and a voiceover button to hear a song title, playlist name, or battery status. The last product under this name was iPod Touch 7th generation, introduced on May 28, 2019, which featured the A10 Fusion chip enabling immersive augmented reality experiences and group FaceTime, along with 256 gigabytes of storage. Soon, iPod will disappear from shops forever. Novelties by Microsoft. Microsoft starts selling USB flash drives with Windows 11. Windows 11 operating system was released last October, and it is only now that Microsoft decided to present a box version of this operating system on physical media. You can already see it on sale on, in various online stores. For example, you can find it at Best Buy stores in the USA. Windows 11 on physical media is currently sold in two versions, Home and Pro. The first costs $139.99, and the second $199.99. At the same prices, you can choose to buy digital licenses of these operating systems. The box version of Windows 11 contains a USB flash drive with an operating system installer and a digital license key to activate it. Although most users are unlikely to choose using the physical method of installing the new operating system, it's always good to have an alternative. For many years, Microsoft supported the option of installing operating systems from physical media. This time, owners of Windows 11 physical copies will also get a nice-looking USB flash drive in an attractive box. By the way, that's a good method to save some money on buying a digital version of Windows 11. At the moment, Amazon Online Store offers a licensed copy of Windows 10 Pro at only $85, which means there is a discount of $45. As soon as you buy it, you can upgrade to Windows 11 for free. Also, Windows 11 received a few updates. Now it has Xbox controller bar for easier access to games via the Xbox controller. This bar will appear automatically every time the computer is paired with an Xbox controller. If you ever need to bring up the bar again, just press the center button on the Xbox controller or use the key shortcut G Win on a computer. On the Xbox controller bar, you will be able to see game shortcuts and widgets. If you open the bar while gaming, it will only display widgets. Also, Microsoft will prohibit using Windows 11 without creating an account. Microsoft will no longer let users install Windows 11 on their computers before they connect the devices to the internet and create an account with this company. Previously, this limitation only covered Windows 11 Home Edition, but now it also applies to the Pro version as well. Well.
Google Updates. Google Translate begins saving translate history to user accounts. Some users report that when starting the application, they see a suggestion to back up their translation history. However, you may refuse this option and keep on using the service in a regular way. In Google Translate settings, now there is a new tab called History, where you can see your translations arranged in a chronological order. Some translations can be stored for quicker access. This feature can be synchronized with the cloud storage space to keep your backups there. Also, the company released an option to automatically fix stolen or broken passwords. This feature was announced last year, but it only worked with a limited list of websites. According to 9to5Google, automatic password replacement has been introduced gradually for some users since last November. This new function is based on one of the latest technologies by Google, Duplex for Web, which is meant to automate some routine tasks such as scrolling, clicking, and filling in online forms. Samsung announced UFS 4 storage for smartphones. Samsung has presented the latest version of UFS 4.0 flash storage for smartphones, which promises a substantial increase in performance in comparison with the previous versions. The new standard offered speeds of up to 23.2 GB per second per lane, which is double that of the previous standard UFS 3.1 currently used in Galaxy S22 flagship devices. Samsung says such high throughput capacity makes the new storage solution an ideal choice for 5G smartphones which have to handle large volumes of data. The company expects the UFS 4 standard to be accepted by car industry and by businesses involved in production of augmented reality and virtual reality solutions. UFS 4 flash storage comes equipped with Samsung's 7th generation VNet memory chips and a proprietary controller. This combination promises a sequential read speed of up to 4200 megabyte megabytes per second and a sequential write speed of up to 2800 megabytes per second. With all that, this kind of memory is more energy efficient. It is 46% better than the previous generation. UFS 4 by Samsung will have maximum dimensions of 11 by 13 by 1 mm and will be available in several capacity versions up to 1 terabyte. Birds Attack 2022 Ukrainian developers Oleksiy Novohatsky and Marina Harchenko created a new patriotic game, Birds Attack 2022. They had this idea after the Russian propaganda claimed Ukraine had built secret biological laboratories to breed genetically modified birds for war. Another source of their inspiration included all kinds of war-related memes. This is how the game Birds Attack 2022 appeared, its main character being a battle duck. The developers tried to include well-known locations and images that everyone has been talking about for the last few months. That's why birds attack players will see Chernobyovka and the Red Forest, the sinking Russian warship and the burning oil depots of Belgorod, and of course the famous Ukrainian tractors towing away captured Russian armor. Also, the developers added a few fictional events. The invaders are portrayed as armed soldiers and looters who steal poultry and carpets alike. When you reach the final level, you'll have to fight Putin in his bunker. This was the fifth episode of IT News. Be sure to explore our channel, it's full of useful videos about fine-tuning and optimizing computers and, of course, about data recovery, both from PC and many other devices. See you again in another video. Hello, friends! If you need to recover deleted data, view or restore removed browsing history, Hetman Software Products will help you. Follow the link in the description, download the necessary program for free, install it and analyze the disk. The utility will show you the data you can recover, so you'll be able to view it or get it back. In our channel and blog, you will find solutions to any problem, from installing an operating system or configuring it to fixing possible bugs and errors or optimizing mobile gadgets. Our specialists will answer any questions you ask in your comments under the videos or articles. While you're watching this video, civilians in Ukraine are dying from attacks and bombardments of the Russian Federation. Putin's insane regime has attacked a peaceful country in the very heart of Europe. Support the Ukrainian army by making a contribution to the fund Come Back Alive. Use the QR code or the link below the video to transfer any amount of money that will boost Ukrainian resistance and help it counter Russia's dishonorable invasion.